Not every home cook has a pastry bag on hand, and if you're just doing some simple piping, you really don't need one. As long as you've got a zipper lock bag and these test kitchen tips, you can pipe with confidence whenever you want. To make your own pastry bag, just grab a zipper lock bag. It's much easier to fill the bag when it's propped up and open, so we recommend placing it in something that's large enough to fit the bag once it's full, such as a tall, wide glass, a measuring cup, or even an empty Pringles can. Fold back the first few inches of the bag and start by dropping in a few small scoops of the filling. Gravity and a couple of shakes will help the filling move to the bottom of the bag. You can use a spoon or a rubber spatula to fill the bag, but if you've got one on hand, an ice cream scoop or a portion scoop does the job neatly and efficiently. Once the bag is nearly full, squeeze out the excess air and seal it with a couple of quick twists. Then use scissors to cut off the bottom corner of the bag. When piping, hold the bag from the back, behind the filling, and squeeze gently, guiding the tip with your free hand. And there you go. A zipper lock bag and some simple tips is all you need to pipe like a pro.